What's up, everybody? It's your boy Hugh here from Creator Up. Filming me right now is a brand new Insta360 EVO VR 180 switch to 360 camera. And this is in VR 180, definitely watching the headset. Right now, I'm in front of my hotel in Abu Dhabi in UAE. And you can see that epic building over there. Pretty nice. If you turn around with me, you see the convention centers and the sunset is just setting right behind me. Again, the EVO is on a selfie stage. You know, walking with me in a vlogger style. That's probably how people are gonna use this camera as a vlogging camera in VR 180, which is gonna be huge if a lot of vloggers wanna like talk to their audience in VR headset. So how good is the stabilization of the Insta360 EVO? Now you see it because I'm walking backward with a handheld on a selfie stick. So let me just walk a little bit faster. You see my angle, I'm walking toward that really, really fancy hotel over there in the distance. You see it in 3D, hopefully. And one thing about Abu Dhabi is a massive, everything is really big. But let's do a crazy turn, vlogging style, and check out the hotel I'm staying at. This is my hotel. I stay here for the next whole month, doing the whole game. Uh, yeah, I miss home. I miss home a lot. But I have been on the road for a while right now. So. Yeah, let's do a sidewalk. So right now I'm walking at the side, holding my hand, holding the camera. So that might not feel too comfortable in VR 180. But let's see how good it looks for a stabilization built inside a VR 180 camera. Now let's look, do a classic walking stuff. You just keep walking straight, uh, crossing the road. I was hit by a car. But yeah, those are people, how people usually walk, right? Holding the camera on a selfie stick, talking in front of the camera uh, with, you know, uh, with the audience and see the sun is epic right now if you hopefully see the sun right there right behind me let's see how good is the dynamic range of this camera so sun epic building behind in front of the sun and me and everything and we are 180. so let's walk back to where we start and do another side walking okay this is another angle for self vlogging and this is an other angle for self vlogging. Uh, that's the GoPro style angle. The hand out of the selfie stick. The camera is really, really light. And also this shot in a log mode. So see how good is the dynamic range on a log mode of a camera. And now I gotta run with it. Let's see how good is VR one in the in motion with the precision for the Insta360 EVO. Here is a straight on 3D 180 photo from the EVO. EVO takes 18 megapixel 3D photo. The photo resolution is 6080 times 3040. But let's face it, this photo is boring. It will be more fun to take 3D selfie with the EVO like this. I think EVO can create a trend for a 3D 180 selfie because it's pocket friendly size and easy to use timer feature. Anything you love in the Insta360 ONE X photo features are available in EVO as well, including Blackadin HDR photo and long exposure photo. Here is a one second interval VR 180 time lapse of Abu Dhabi sunset to again show the great dynamic range of this little camera. Although, Tablet does not have flow state stabilization. Nighttime photo and video is other features that stand out. Look at this photo taken in the midnight of Abu Dhabi out of my hotel room. Even though it is a little bit soft, you cannot really see visible digital noise. Here is a video with auto exposure. As you see, the footage is not noisy at all and totally usable. For a small sensor camera, this is very impressive compared to its competitor like the Lenovo Mirage. Worth to mention, the EVO already come with HDR video feature just like the One X. 
the next video, I will review everything you need to know about the Insta360 EVO. EVO is not just another VR180 camera. It has innovative features that other competitors do not have. I will show you an Insta360 phone cover that let you view 3D photo and video directly from your phone without VR headset called Holoframe Naked Eye 3D Playback. The software will use your phone camera to track your eyes movement and create real 3D effects, which might be the thing to make 3D popular again. I will also compare the EVO with Lenovo Mirage, Kendall Cool Cam, and my personal favorite, View XR, another 5.7K VR180 camera. So don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you next time.